Hello everyone, you are tuning into Destin Sites with me, Zach, today. I hope you're all doing well and having an amazing day as always. Wherever you're watching this, whether it's morning, afternoon, or night, you're tuning in with me and I hope you all enjoy as we, I have a special surprise for you and a new adventure coming. Stay tuned. We're going to Genève uh, and yeah, so should be great. Uh, I'm just here at uh, Forum des Halles. Uh, absolutely beautiful. Let me just show you all. It's kind of like a park and then there's this like big like church slash building and then there's like this this other building over there looks kind of like uh, lo like you know with the the dome uh, top uh, it's absolutely beautiful uh, it's really nice uh, weather's extremely extremely nice today in uh, Paris France you know we got like 23 degrees sun's out it's beautiful you know we're getting that vitamin D that uh, that we so much you know needed uh, I mean, it's been gloomy these past days, so I'm just happy to be back with y'all with a new adventure and we're heading to Genève. So Switzerland, here we come. Hey everyone, just a little update. I have just made it inside of the train. Uh, unfortunately, um, the train was moved from Paris Gare de Bercy to Paris Gare de Lyon. So yeah, I'm just on the train everyone. Uh, it's extremely packed. But yeah, I'm super excited. We're heading to uh, first destination is is going to be La Roche Mijon. Uh, so update y'all there. Peace. evening for me uh, good morning to some of y'all good afternoon to some of y'all hope you're all doing amazing having an amazing day so just a little update as soon as I got to Gare de Lyon uh, right uh, basically Lyon like kind of towards south of France so it's a different region it's not in Paris uh, basically the train that was supposed to go to Geneva Switzerland which is where we're supposed to be going where we're supposed to be right now because of the manifestations and and all these things that's been going on in france uh les grèves as they call them um unfortunately you know trains have been delayed some of them have been cancelled so what ended up happening is they ended up getting us a hotel um, to compensate us for basically like what ended up happening um but yeah so tomorrow morning i'm gonna catch some sleep Here's the hotel, just, you know, watching highlights of the game. Unfortunately, Real Madrid, we did not win. We lost extremely badly, but it is what it is. Anyways, uh, yeah, just going to need to catch some sleep, wake up tomorrow, grab some breakfast and head out.
anyways as always peace out everyone stay tuned for our next adventure and i'll keep you all updated bye hello and good morning dustin sites family i hope you're all doing well i apologize for my rustic sounding voice uh, i just woke up took a shower um yeah sleep wasn't too bad i got some decent amount of sleep slept as early as possible it is currently 7 30 i'm about to go grab breakfast and uh, head on the train to go to geneva switzerland so yeah it going Destin Sites family I hope you're all doing amazing having a great day I have now made it to Switzerland Geneva finally we made it to our destination after all the complications uh, that I have explained uh, but yeah I'm so very excited we're here uh, and yeah we're just heading to our uh, to the hotel where we're staying at and yeah just just look at the view it's absolutely beautiful And then uh, if we walk actually this way, I'll show you all, but you can see the mountains. So it's absolutely beautiful. And it's just, I'm just so very excited. Uh, men, met a young French uh, gentleman, absolutely kind, uh, gave me a bunch of recommendations. So I'm very excited. We're gonna have to check those places out. So I'll keep you all updated. Cheers. Hello, Dustin Sites family. We are here in Geneva, Switzerland. So I just went, I was at the hotel put my stuff down they give you like private lockers i had a lock put my you know all my stuff and uh and yeah we're just about to go to a spot that's actually really popular uh i'll tell you all the name it's called ben du uh so the lovely gentleman that was on the train recommended this place so i'm super excited tune in uh and yeah So, uh, fact of the day, everyone, is um, I'm sure a lot of you probably already know this, but in Switzerland, they actually don't use euro. 
they uh, they use Swiss uh, Swiss franc uh, SCF. I'm pretty sure that's what it stands for. I'm gonna put at the bottom what it stands for. And uh, apparently before um, the euro was actually worth more, but now uh, you know it's actually the same because of you know everything that's been going on with the economy and whatnot. But yeah, it's interesting. All right, Dustin Sites family. So we made it uh, to this like kind of nice uh, lake, beach-ish. It's absolutely beautiful. Let me show you all. So that that's the place we're actually gonna head to over there. It's a uh, pretty popular like water jet, and then I think that's the old city. So we're definitely gonna have to go check that out, everyone. But man, it's just, it's absolutely beautiful. Love it. People are just walking. Oh, look, we have beautiful swan. Hello, Dustin Sites family. Just a little update, still walking along this beautiful um, coast. You can see, you can smell, you know, the, the water, just amazing. And then here we have kind of like, uh, where like uh, all the boats, people keep their boats. Uh, so yeah, it's really nice. Looks amazing, smells amazing. Just getting that fresh air uh, with the beautiful scenery everywhere. So really busy. Absolutely beautiful, everyone. Uh, I mean, just the smell of the, uh, you know, the ocean, the sea. I believe that this is connected uh, some way. The water that comes here is connected some way by the uh, the sea, the Mediterranean Sea. Uh, so just absolutely beautiful. Water is, you know, kind of a blue lagoonish color. It's it's amazing, like kind of a blue greenish color. It's amazing. And you just have people uh, walking and, you know, kids running everywhere and it's amazing. All right, this Insights family, we're on the boat right now. We're heading over to the other part. So super excited everyone, I'm gonna keep you all updated. All right, Dustin Sites family, just a little update. I have made it to the other side of, uh, you know, the wherever I started, I forgot what's the name. I'm gonna put it at the bottom left. It just looks absolutely beautiful. But everyone, I just wanna introduce you all to some, you know, lovely uh, Parisian people that I have met and they're actually uh, originally from Morocco. I just want you all to say hello to these lovely ladies we have here. Hello, Miss Devine. Hello, everyone. I'm Gina. Hi, I'm uh, Samia. Hey, how are you? So, yeah, we're going to be exploring Switzerland, Geneva together because we're uh, all traveling here and we're actually new to town. So, it's going to be fun. So, just stay tuned, everyone. We're going to be exploring. Peace.
All right, that's inside family. I'm here at Jardin des Anglais. And this is just a fountain and it's absolutely beautiful. You know, we got people just coming here to relax, get some work done, go on a date, amazing. So we're actually heading um, over there. There's like a special place where there's like just a bunch of bushes, flowers and everything and it and they kind of trimmed it and maintained it to become like kind of nostalgic piece of uh, art, a touristic area. So yeah, we're gonna check that out. All right, everyone, so I made it to the flower clock. It's a pretty popular uh, place here. So just wanted to uh, show y'all. So yeah, it's uh, it's actually pretty beautiful and it actually changes uh, with the seasons. So I guess right now, season they got uh, red flowers. Um, if you look on Google, they have yellow flowers. But yeah, it's uh, it's pretty nice. It's uh, it's in kind of the center area uh, over there. We got the Ferris wheel here, uh, and then over there we just got like kind of like where we came from the bridge, and then like. Uh, little like walkway that everyone walks on uh, beside the water so yeah All right, that's inside family. Just a small update. We've made it to uh, the Cathédrale Saint Pierre Genève, and it's just absolutely beautiful, very historical building, and yeah, magnificent. It's kind of in the center like area, so we're gonna go in and check it out. Absolutely beautiful everyone. It's just magnificent, beautiful, very peaceful as I said. Love it. This is absolutely beautiful and it's and it's incredible. I was actually talking to uh, our new friends here. Oh, it's incredible to believe that back in the day, this church used to be full of people coming to pray, right? And how could the pastor, when he would, you know, when there would be masses, how would he be able to speak to everyone? So we, we, we were saying that the way this building is actually built, it uh, probably allows sound to resonate or there was someone who used to sit at the top over there and there's these tubes you speak into and then clearly the tubes kind of like you can hear it all over the church but it's absolutely incredible and then just look uh, and also the, the, the you know the paintings on the mirrors are just incredible
Hello everyone, how's it going? So I'm here with two of the lovely locals that work here and they're gonna recommend us. So we're here with yeah, Anna? 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 Anna and Argio. Argio. Thank you everyone. Welcome them, Destin Sites. Uh, so uh, Anna, the lovely Anna was gonna recommend us some stuff. So you can try it. This one is a local one, it's a caraca. And you have the biscuits with dark chocolate. And also we have homemade chocolate. Everything is uh, homemade and we do it uh, just ourselves, just over there. So, um, yeah. which one you prefer, milk? Uh, I think we're gonna try some dark chocolate and we'll yeah. let you know, Anna, so, how it tastes. Okay, so you have to try this one, it's a classic one, the truffle, yeah. with ganache and dark chocolate. Yeah. And also, the different one is a milk chocolate, the classic one. Yeah. And maybe something special. Do you like a cinnamon? Yeah, sure. Let's try it. Okay. One okay. more? Uh, I think that's good for now, unless you recommend something else. And you said the one of the ganache, right? Like the little cakes, uh, this one. Yeah. Me, it's the best. yeah. If you're saying it's the best, you know, uh, we'll take your word for it. Do so. Uh, no, just for here to sit. Yeah. All right, everyone. I'm gonna let y'all know. We're just gonna get seated, uh, try it out, and I'll let everyone y'all know if it's uh, if it's good. So uh, thank you again to Anna for the great recommendation. Hello, everyone. Just a little update. So I ended up having a cappuccino. I was drinking it. I didn't want it to get cold. So we ended up going with the recommendation from Anna, and you ended up getting a cake. So it looks like a chocolate cake. We have uh, apple pie and then hot chocolate. So we'll let you all know if it tastes good. With my new friends. <laughs> all right, everyone. So I'm gonna taste the chocolate and I'm gonna let you all know how it tastes like. So first I'm gonna start with the dark chocolate. Uh, Aiden, I know you love dark chocolate and I know you're telling me how I need to try dark chocolate once I'm in, when I'm in Switzerland. So let's try it out. Has a very um, salt, salty taste, like a crunch. So it's kind of a crunchy outside, and then the inside is kind of more of a soft, uh, chocolatey filling. It's absolutely amazing. I uh, I think that this is uh, around. Um, it's seventy percent dark chocolate. It's not you know a hundred percent, but it's it's amazing. It's not too sweet, right? Uh, so it's good. And yeah, so let's try the milk chocolate now. So this one's a lot more sweet. I think I, I'm a fan of uh, the dark chocolate more. I've been really digging coffee, dark chocolate a lot more. So for me, I'd give the dark chocolate a 10 out of 10. Switzerland chocolate is definitely really good. Milk chocolate, 7 out of 10, it's too sweet for me. So let's try this other one. Mm. Um, this one's good. It's not really my thing. The inside is um, it's kind of like a buttery uh, texture. It's, um, it's definitely good. But uh, I still think that the dark chocolate's number one, the milk chocolate number two, and then this one. So this one, I would give it another, another seven out of ten for sure. Now let's try the the tart. It's uh, with ganache. So. Yeah, this is bomb, everyone. This is amazing. This is has a nice chocolate ganache. Very crunchy, soft on the inside. is amazing. This one, you have to try it. So great recommendation from my new friend Anna, the worker, lovely um, lady, you know, helped me out. And yeah, she, she was right, this is amazing. So peace everyone. Hello everyone. So we're actually like kind of towards the end of the park and you can just see people are just playing giant chess.
So I guess it's extremely popular. Uh, and I mean, yeah, like look, we got regular pawn, horse, king, queen, bishop. Just looks, uh, just looks like a lot of fun. So if it frees up, they even they so they have chest and chess. And people come, they just play, and it's amazing. Yeah, it just really looks uh, nice, fun, relaxing. So I'm definitely gonna put the name if I haven't already of the place at the bottom, and we're just gonna head there next. Looks really nice and uh, full of history. Stay tuned. absolutely beautiful i mean the ladies have been walking all day we've been walking all day everyone so they just wanted to just like sit down and just relax so i don't blame them i'm probably gonna do the same for a bit over over there you can kind of see the beach as they call it um we're gonna definitely have to check that out and then there's this beautiful just you know building over here absolutely amazing if i find the name i'll put it but just look at the scenery everyone All right, Dustin Sites family, we've made it. Just look at this beautiful view. We got the mountain ranges in, you know, in the back and you can just see it, it's absolutely beautiful. All right, everyone, so I'm just here at uh, Genève uh, Plage. So beach of Geneva and yeah, it's uh, it's pretty nice. It's I mean, it's pretty chilly today So but you can see like the ducks the swans are just swimming and yeah 